Hi, this info session is part of a wider user uptake strategy of the European Commission. One of the aims of that strategy is to stimulate the development and use of innovative downstream applications that incorporate Copernicus data and services. One of the objectives of CMEMS is to provide different levels of information dedicated to both scientific community and other users like public authorities or industrial companies. These submodules showcase the ability of CMEMS products to provide ocean color information to derive indicators of algae bloom. It is dedicated to the access of the products such as mass concentration of chlorophyll in seawater and optical property measurement giving information about transparency, organic materials and suspended matter in seawater. The objectives of the module are to show another view of ocean color products, both model and observations, to choose a product displaying near real-time ocean color from satellite observation, to access the Python command line example and to give indication on how to adapt it, and to show a comparison of CMEMS level 4 products to level 1 and 2 <coughs> ocean color products available on other portals. The particular use case shown here concern the monitoring of ocean color in the Baltic Sea to evaluate the presence of algae bloom and suspended matter in seawater. To access the specific product, you just have to go on the Copernicus Marine Environmental website. The video hereafter displays the step-by-step -step process which is necessary for your registration. Once on the CMEMS website, then you just have to click on register now on the right part to access the user registration form. First of all, click on the service commitment and license and read the corresponding document. It describes in details how the service is made and the role of the service desk in supporting users. It also includes information about name of the products, the geographical areas concerned. Returning to the user registration form, now you can complete the requested information about you, such as your user details, type of your organization or organization details or areas of relevance for which you would like the product. You can activate several sections. You can also mention how you heard about CMEMS. At the bottom of the page, you have to sign the service level agreement by accepting in terms and condition of the CMEMS license and enter the proposed code and send the form. You will then receive an email from the CMEMS service desk with your login and password and first information for an easy quick start. The email also displays links to video tutorials. This presentation aims at giving a brief overview of ocean color products. The next video will show you how to access the products to identify near real-time products of chlorophyll concentration information and to adapt the provided Python command line to be used for automatic download. Here we show a particular use case, how to get information about ocean color in the North Atlantic region. A first approach consists in selecting the products resulting from modeling, biogeochemical models mostly provide mass concentration of chlorophyll in seawater only. To do so, we have to select models product. Each modeling area provides such information. Then, we have to click on ocean chlorophyll as a parameter to select only this biogeochemical parameter. A second approach consists in selecting the products coming from satellite observations. To do so, we have to return to the main menu to unselect the models and ocean chlorophyll, but to select the satellite observation instead. To refine the request on ocean color observations only, then we indicate in the keyword search area the word ocean color. To access near real time product, click on the button near real time. Choose the product relative to near real time chlorophyll in the Atlantic by clicking in on more information. You access the product page of the selected product. To reach the Python command line, click on download product. You can modify the requested date and then click on download. Then you can either download manually by clicking on the right download button indicating the size of the file, either look for a script that will give you the possibility to automatically download files. Choose the dataset and click on the button View Script. To execute this command line, you have to copy and paste 
in your editor window and proceed to modifications. Here is the complete command line. The first necessary changes are the update of the directory path for your Python and Motu. Then you have to indicate your CMEMS login and password in the command line. The name of the product as well as the name of the selected dataset are indicated here in green. According to your needs, you can modify the geographical extent of download. In that case, change the longitude and the, max and the latitude as shown in the command line. You can also modify the start date and the end date of the extraction following the shown format. Finally, give the name of the output file and the name of the directory where the extraction will be written. This slide gives complementary information concerning the HTTP proxy you use. Contact your system administrator to get help if need be. Once all the changes are done, execute the command line into a terminal window. This last slide shows the advantage of using level 3 or level 4 products available from CMEMS versus level 1 or level 2 products. On the left here, a visualization of the mass concentration of chlorophyll in seawater the 17th of April of 2016. It was downloaded from the CMEMS catalog. This level 4 product is a result of the combination of multi-sensor data. On the right, a map of the mass concentration of chlorophyll in seawater the same day obtained from the portal Ocean Color Web from NOAA, which displays a level 2 product characterized by a lot of data gaps compared to the one we just unloaded from CMEMS. Thank you for watching this video, I hope it helps.